The 10 0 and 0 Hopkinton Hillers hockey team took on Ashland this past Wednesday. The Hillers netted three goals in the first period, including this one three minutes into action. Side. Let's check, stick check there by Walsh. Weinstock with a shot. That is turned away, then it's popped in. Goal Hillers, Aiden Walsh on the rebound. Now Walsh started that play in the neutral zone, made a nice play to break up Ashland. And got rewarded by being in front for that open net. Puts it up the near side of Walsh. Walsh trying to drive up ice. Here he comes. Look out. Driving it. Goal! Sean Walsh does it again. And forced out of the net there. And then it's popped in again. And that's Kyle Rogers. A great play by Rogers there. The goal, he actually had it tied up. And Rogers was able to chip it free from under the glove and tuck it right in. 33 seconds into the second period, the Hillers netted another one. And Westwood, 4-5 and 1, rounding out the TVL large. Good tip in front there, I think Rogers is going to stick on that one. Oh, what a shot by Gilbert. He put it in. That went off the netting in the back, 4-0 Hillers. Ashland responded with a pair of goals of their own in the second, but the Hillers put them away with three more goals in the third. Merida, back to Kirk. Kirk looking for a shot and it's in! Dan Kirk! <laughs> Rogers over to Walsh. Back to Rogers. With a shot and in! Oh boy! Kyle Rogers with the spin around. And a Diavonzo's hand. And the defense were trying to give it back to him, and as he's trying to give his stick back, Pavit Mira says, I'm going to score right now. Well, it's now a scoring fest for the, the top scorers on the team are all uh, figured in here in about the last minute. Hopkinton takes the game 7-2 and improves to a perfect 11 wins, no losses, no ties on the season. Hopkinton boys and girls swimming recently improved to 9-2 on the season. They took down Westwood. 99 to 76. The Hillers have won their last several meets and continue to flourish. Hillers boys basketball dropped a tough game to Somerville. The game was a scrimmage and doesn't count towards playoff seeding. Overall, boys basketball is 8 and 4 on the season, but at 8 and 3 playoff seeding wise. On Tuesday night, Hillers girls basketball dropped a tough one versus Holliston. It was a 40 to 36 final. The game went back and forth the entire way, but despite a great effort by the Hillers, Holliston pulled off the win. The young Hopkinton Hillers girls team are now three and six on the season.